Right, first responders from our area working hard to help the people from areas devastated by Helene. Marcee King joining us now in the studio to tell us what local agencies are doing to try to help people pick up the pieces. From sheriff's offices on the Treasure Coast to the South Florida region of the American Red Cross, agencies and volunteers across our area are doing their part to help fellow Floridians during such an incredibly difficult time. The Indian River County Sheriff's Office sent 13 deputies to Sewanee County. They've been there for a few days and they'll be there for at least another week. Including uh, trailers and um, ATVs, side-by-sides and airboat, um, a lot of chainsaws and things like that to get some of the roads open, get some of these uh, uh, residents uh, food and water um, at some distribution centers. Sergeant Clifford Labby says those distribution centers are critical because so many store shelves remain empty. He says some of the work the deputies are doing include removing trees from homes and roadways and assisting the Sewanee and Bay County Sheriff's offices by helping those agencies take calls. They're so thankful to see us up here that we've traveled all that way to come up here. If I was in that position and I needed help, I would want people to um, come to our county to see if they could help us out in uh, times of need also, because we're all uh, fellow Floridians and we need to take care of each other. Deputies with the Martin County Sheriff's Office are in Lafayette County. Deputies can be seen here patrolling the area to prevent crime. They are also watching over the town's emergency food supply and ensuring residents safely receive their emergency meal boxes. As for the American Red Cross in South Florida, I spoke with a staff member based out of Miami who was back in Fort Myers after staff and volunteers have already been spending the last two years helping the people there recover following Hurricane Ian. We're, so, we're really proud of the work that we've done here. So for, for the people of Fort Myers and Pine Island and Lee County, they they, they're resilient, but you can you can feel the despair. In addition, five volunteers from the Palm Beach and Treasure Coast chapter of the Red Cross are in the panhandle working to help people there recover. Reporting in the studio, Steve King, WPBF 25 News.